Okay, so for my job, I am required to have steel toe um, boots or shoes. So I purchased these, um, these shoes here. They are the Herman Survivors Professional Series Legendary Quality Scraper Scrapper. I got it in size 12 because I have big feet. And uh, they were made with. Uh, Read this Enduro Pro Poo in Sight foot, Footbed Waterproof Full Grained Leather Composite Anti Puncture Insole Board Reinforced Rubber Toe Wool and Slip Resistant Outsole Non Metallic and High Visibility Panels. So this is what I got, professional series scraper is what it's called, legendary quality. And of course just like everything, it's made in, made in China because the United States doesn't sell, doesn't make anything. So made in China. So we're going to do a review of these boots. And like I said, I got them for work, and they require um, steel toe shoes, steel toe boots, and these are composite toe. And I can also use these for hiking since they have they're waterproof, and I do a lot of hiking, so I'll have two different purposes for them. So we're going to open up the package and take a look at the boots and do a review of them. <laughs> Here's the oil. There's a little note. It says professional series. We've been we've been making top quality outdoor boots since 1879. We demonstrated our commitment to our customers by producing durable, dependable, and comfortable footwear. From traditional work boots to outdoor shoes and boots for work and recreation. Our footwear is constructed with the best and latest materials for long-term durable performance. We protect your feet in rough terrain while keeping them dry and comfortable. And our updated contemporary styles make Herman survivors suitable for on and off the job. So here they are. These boots. This is the left boot. So it looks pretty neat. There's the sole of it. Pretty good treads and reflective thing in the back and a little tag from In Survivors Professional Series. So, uh, and there's the composite toe. side, the right foot, waterproof, I said, which is not which is what I need because I do a lot of hiking, so these will be have a multiple purpose boot that I can use, There's some label information, Enduro Pro, safety information, safety toe cap may crack after impact or compression. Immediately place the footwear should this occur. Damaged or cracked toe cap may not meet ASTM F4213 standard and will not protect your foot. So if I ever image it, better do it. And there's some more information about the same thing, about what Herman survivors do and Herman boots and the scraper brand. And I paid uh, $79.99 with these boots at Walmart. Might have been $74.99, I have to look at the receipt. So we're gonna try them on and uh, finish the review of this. Here are the laces. The laces look pretty durable. I had to place my boots that I have on now anyway because the bottom of it is basically worn out, so 
I'll be able to use because I do a lot of hiking and walking around and so these will make up for it and like I said I can use it for multiple use because I can go hiking I can go hiking with these as well. And they'll be they're kind of heavy. I weigh most about a pound. But uh be able to be use them for hiking on the mountains and the trails that I go on, which are pretty sometimes pretty rough trails. So let's try them on. Like I said, the laces are pretty strong. They have this little, uh, what do we call them? And they have the very normal laces here. And they are reflective. So you'll be able to see me in the dark. <laughs> and there's the tongue. Size uh, thing made in China, of course different information of the sizes and there is this padding of the foot foot pad heel pad all right so let's try them on okay so i got my foot in the boot so we'll lace them up and i feel pretty comfortable at, at this point and uh let's put them let's tie the boot up okay so i got them laced up Feel pretty comfortable. Of course, Max has to get involved. Come on. Um, so I feel pretty comfortable in the, in the, the foot. So let's stand up and see how they feel. Feel pretty comfortable. Ta da! Here's the composite toe. Steel toe boots. So. They're pretty comfortable, size 12. I'll be wearing these at work for a 10 hour shift, so they need to be comfortable and need to stay uh, padded. I may have to put um, work, work socks in it to make it a little more padded. Or I can also get another boot and sole. <laughs> All right, so there's the review. So far, so good.